Do you remember Monica from an earlier concept? Monica earns $8 per week for doing her chores. But her little brother Tyler earns a different amount of money because he's younger and doesn't have as many chores to do. Tyler earns $6 per week for doing chores. Given this information, can you write an equation to show how many weeks it will take Tyler to earn $54. Let's take a look at how to do that. First, we want to figure out how many weeks it would take Tyler. The weeks is the question mark. That's our unknown. Let's use a variable to show weeks. We can use the variable W. Now think about what we know. We know that Tyler earns $6 per week, so we can put 6 times the number of weeks as the first part of the equation equals, and we want to know how many weeks it's going to take him to earn $54. So it makes sense that 6 times the number of weeks will give us 54. This is how we can write an equation to describe the situation. Now let's think about how to solve that equation. We have 6w equals 54. Now, we want 6 times some number of weeks. We want to figure out the number of weeks, so we're going to get that w by itself. To do that, we use the inverse operation and divide both sides by 6. These cancel, bring down the w. 6 goes into 54 nine times. This tells us that it will take Tyler nine weeks to earn $54. Can we write a similar equation for Monica? Certainly. We know that Monica earns $8 per week. Let's say we wanted to know how many weeks it would take Monica to earn $72. That's what we want to know. We can again use W for weeks. The weeks is unknown. Now let's write an equation. 8W, $8 times the number of weeks, equals 72. We want to figure out how many weeks. Divide both sides by 8. These cancel. The weeks equals 9. Just like Tyler, it would take him 9 weeks to earn his $54. It will take Monica 9 weeks to earn $72. What about if we wanted to figure out how much money Tyler would earn after 8 weeks of work? Well, we know he makes $6 an hour. We know the weeks, so remember our equation before was 6w equals 54. But now we want to know how much money he makes after 8 weeks. So w, we know that, so we can substitute 6 times 8 equals, and we can put an m for money. That's our variable now. That's what we want to figure out. 6 times 8 is 48 equals the amount of money that Tyler will earn. Now we know how much money Tyler will earn after 8 weeks of work.